guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Coach Lewis, this is Professor Andrew, and today we're gonna be going over a 50-50 entry from the knee on belly position, um, and then a transition in if your partner decides to roll out of your uh, heel hook. Cool, so before we get started, just make sure to check out our sponsors, Nations Athletic, Jiu-Jitsu Apparel for everyone. Make sure to give them, uh, uh, make sure to check them out. The link is gonna be down in the description. Cool. All right guys, so we're gonna start in this knee on belly position here. And what we're looking to expose is when my partner hip escapes here and he turns his legs over to this side, I'm looking for that little bit of window so I can get my sh my uh, shoelaces on my posted foot to go behind me just like this and trap his leg. So now my free hand is gonna catch his knee. As I sit back, I'm gonna shoot my legs through, get my knee behind his uh, knee as a wedge, and I'm gonna cross my feet here, entering the 50-50 position with the foot on the outside. Now typically here, I can start turning to attack an outside heel hook, okay? Which is gonna force my partner to roll, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start switching the foot to the inside position. As my partner begins to roll here, I start turning my knees, I control the knee, and I bring both of my knees to the mat, okay? So as I bring both my knees to the back, I can elbow back to clamp his toes to my ribs, and I'm able to catch the heel hook grip right here, okay, on the roll. As we continue to roll here, we're gonna land in a 50-50 position with my feet, uh, with his foot on the inside and I have the heel. I can turn my knees inward, fall to my shoulder to make sure that the ankle is completely tracked, the toes are connected to my ribs, and I'm gonna lift my hips, pointing my knees down to the mat to finish the submission here, okay? So one more time. We start the on belly here, okay? As they start to escape, I step, I back step, and I place my shoelaces behind my partner's knee, creating a wedge. So my free hand is gonna collect my partner's knee, and as I sit back, I'm gonna get uh, that knee that was blocking his leg. I'm gonna shoot that knee through and create a wedge around his leg, okay? As I cross my feet. So now I'm gonna tilt my knees inside like this, which is gonna prompt my partner to start turning. So I start passing the leg over, and I control my partner's knee. I place my elbow in front of the toes. I begin to rotate. And as I do, I point my knees down to the mat and I elbow back and I pinch my partner's toes to my ribs and then exposes the heel. From here, I continue to roll. I catch the heel at my wrist and I point both my knees inward here like this, okay? I wanna make sure I don't stay on my elbow. I wanna go down to my shoulder so that his toes are completely sealed and locked in between his feet here. So as you can see here, I'm leaning on my elbow so his foot is trapped. So now all I have to do is lift my hips so that the knees are pointing diagonally downward. And then from here, I can bridge as I look over my right shoulder to finish uh, with a heel hook submission. Cool. So uh, that's one of the entries that we've been messing around with uh, a lot lately. So what do you guys think about it? I want you guys to leave a comment down in the comment section. Make sure to subscribe. And as always, for those who are already subscribed, and you get one of those. Thank you guys for coming back. We truly appreciate you guys. Make sure to check out Nations Athletic Jiu Jitsu Apparel for Everyone. The link is gonna be down in the, uh, the description. Also, make sure to follow our blog, Beware the Unhook, and stay tuned to the YouTube channel. Make sure you hit the, the bell for notifications, and I'll see you guys next time. All right, peace. <laughs>